What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Machiavelli, and I'm back with another reaction video, man. This is I Know the Truth. I Don't Need a Lie Detector Test. Steve Wilco Show. Normally, somebody like this would be lying already. That's, that's the first thing I'm going to assume. Like, it's obvious, right? Unless you're one of those few percent of people around the world that's telling the truth. But without further ado, man, let's get it. We, we offered you a lie detector test, and... You know, this whole show is based on giving people lie detectors. Right. You refuse to take one. Because I know the truth. I don't need a lie detector test to tell me. Wait, did my boyfriend rape my cousin three times? Oh, God. What What's, what's happened? I know the truth. Well, everybody knows their truth, right? But you come on the show to prove to other people what the truth is, right? Okay. So, I mean, you're accusing a man of a crime that he could go to jail for decades. Yeah. Right. right. He ain't never so getting you out. You don't feel a need to prove he your story, either. especially when it sounds as fishy as it does. Nope. You don't care. I know the truth. Steve. You wouldn't care if Cody goes to jail for 20, 30 years. You wouldn't care. He shouldn't have done what he did to me. So you'd be fine with him going to prison? Yes. And and spending the next 30 years in, in jail? Yes. You'd be okay with that? I would be would okay Would you with like that. to see that? I would. Okay. Let's meet your cousin, Bianca. Which one is it? Which one? Stop. You are going to let me talk. You understand me? You are gonna let me talk and then I will respect you and have your say. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. You're welcome. Which one is it, Savannah? You wanna be with him? You don't remember? Or he raped you? He raped me. Okay, when I went on and confronted you, did you really say that? After I dropped you off, I dropped you off, we were 30 minutes away from each other, okay? Why didn't you text me right there? Because I didn't think you would believe me. You're my cousin, of course I would believe you. I have been there for you, okay? I know no, you what have not. What, what I say? I told you, I am there for you, okay? I know it's your place, you have your rules. I know you had a past with your mother and what happened to you, and I'm sorry about that. But honestly, make up your mind. Why are you refusing us to get a lie detector test? Because I know well, you know what? It's really real that a so-called rapist decided to get a lie detector test, but somebody that is severely trying to be honest with herself ain't taking one. Yeah. She came up there heavy. She came up there. Ooh. She came up there solid. She came up there like rock hard. Yeah. Like. <laughs> sense. I mean, it doesn't. Um, I don't believe any woman uh, would be sexually assaulted and then, you know, not make any effort like you. Yeah, you're yeah. not even in you... the next room. You're inches away. I'm she, right there. All she had to do was go like this. Uh, your boyfriend's doing this. Uh, you know. Or, or, like you, a loud moan or, or like Or like you said, the very next night, not only did she spend the night again, she sleeps next to him and not have you sleep in between, which, come on, man, what is going on? But, so my point to you is, uh, you have a cousin that is making terrible decisions, and maybe, maybe she did fall asleep and maybe he raped her. We're going to find out. I think out. that's really funny how I those do, other two times, it was in the bathroom. I didn't think you were sleeping in the bathroom. But um, the fact that... Um, what? You know, your boyfriend 
or your fiance, whatever yeah. you want to refer him to. Mm -hmm. Why are you still with that guy? To be honest. Yeah, you know, be honest, I'm please. Gonna be, I'm going to say basically what every girl says. You know, I love him. Yeah, and but he's a dirtbag. Yeah. <laughs> and you're a damn liar. You hear me? And you're a damn liar, You're a damn too. liar. Hit me. I'm not hitting. I don't hit women. Why? So you can set him up for that one, too? You can set me up. I was good to you. Yeah. Just because you don't want your boyfriend to find out? I already told my fiance the message I sent you. Yeah? That's Are you life. trying to ruin my life? I could spend pri I could spend 30 years in prison for that. Good, maybe you, you Why don't you take a lie detector test? Because I don't need to. I know the truth. Well, I need to because I'm getting accused of something I didn't do. We came here took a lie detector test, and we asked you, while Savannah was asleep, did you have any sexual activity with her? You answered no. You told the truth. Thank you. I could be. Did you ever have sexual intercourse with Savannah? He answered yes. He told the truth. <laughs> During sexual activity, did Savannah ever verbally resist you? You answered no. You did not tell the truth. What? What? Was all the <laughs> sexual activity you had with Savannah consensual? You answered yes. You did not tell the truth. <laughs> you told the truth. I stood up for you. I told. How stupid does she feel right now? This is the part where I glow up. This is. I'm sorry, you guys, but this is the part where I glow up. I start lighting up like a Christmas tree. Like, <laughs> look at her face. Look at this. This is pure. Damn, you played that shit off smooth. I didn't even know you. you're a good actor for telling me that she that she was coming on to you. But now we see that that's the not truth. the truth. Why is it coming up as you did it? I told the truth. Okay, so what I don't understand <laughs> is <laughs> wait, 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 wait. You're wait. saying that you don't remember. I stood. You guys pay attention. So to that, if you guys watch cartoons or you used to watch cartoons back in the day, I don't care if it was Recess or, you know, uh, um, uh, Rugrats, whatever you guys used to watch, right? Pay attention to his Adam's apple as he swallows his saliva in a nervous manner. Watch this. Up for you. I told the truth. Then why is it coming up as you did it? I told the truth. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> You're saying that you don't remember. Go. Okay, so what I don't <laughs> understand is, you're saying that you don't remember any sexual intercourse. No. But he passes that he never had it with you while you were asleep. I don't remember any sexual intercourse. I do not. Why? Why don't you remember? I don't, know, I don't remember a lot of things. I don't remember. You don't him. remember sexual intercourse? People like that, bro, I swear. I don't believe him. I don't believe her at all. Anybody who say, oh, I don't know. I don't remember. I don't remember a lot of things. That, that doesn't work. Not on me, though. Like okay. Maybe for other people. I, this is a confusing uh, <laughs> results here. Let's bring out Dan to explain. Um, uh, uh, you know, these stories make no sense. Uh, oh, yeah. Somebody saying, you know, I was sexually assaulted, which is terrible, but then I go back for two more nights in a row, and then I go out for pizza, and it does make a lot of sense. But, you know, here he's saying, you know, she wasn't asleep. I did have intercourse, but did she, uh, he fails for uh, her verbally resisting, and was all the sexual activity consensual, uh, and he fails for those two. Right, so let me lay this out for you, Steve. As I've always said here on the show, I'm going to give you Investigator 101. If it doesn't make sense, it's not true, okay? This story does not make sense. So there's components here of doing things without consent. My opinion is that initially she said, no, I have a boyfriend and this is my cousin, and eventually yeah, she consents. Yeah. So, so first so initial, that. be quiet please. Um, initially she says no, 
but during the process of it, she then gives consent. Correct. Okay. And some people have been in situations where you try to get busy with a girl, she says no, and then it turns out to be yes. So right. that's my take on this story. She says, not I didn't have sex with him, I don't remember. I don't remember is a hedge. It's a way to not commit to the statement. Right. It's not yes, it's not no. Well, yeah. if it happened, I don't remember. So she remembers that she had sex. She's just saying, I don't remember because she doesn't want her fiance to find out. Ha ha ha! Ha ha! Yeah! Okay. Now, knowing what we know, would you still be comfortable with sending this guy to jail for 30 years? Okay, wait a minute. Before we even get to that, man, I gotta go back to how. And then he did that like a savage. He did that and walked off. Savage mode. Watch this. Had sex. She's just saying, I don't remember because she doesn't want her fiance to find out. Ah! <laughs> wow. Okay. Now, knowing what we know, would you still be comfortable with sending this guy to jail for 30 years? Maybe. <laughs> hey. He wasn't able to come to me for anything. Bruh, bruh. I love his audience, bro. They, <laughs> they get confused at the things that I get confused about. We all laugh at the same time because, in a way, I'm the audience. I'm watching this just like they watching it. No, I just I just wasn't on a show that you know or whatever. But you know, <laughs> we taking it in. We thinking exactly alike. Me and that audience is thinking exactly alike. We both like, we both say WTF at the same time, and then we both say GTF OH. I think yeah, GTF OH at the same time. So you know, yeah, I got that connection with the audience, bro. I like that. Maybe. <laughs> you should have been able to come to me for anything. Here, you, right. you and me. If you would have just told me right then and there, I probably would have been on your side. There was times when we were at the pizza place, Cody went to the bathroom. You and me were sitting right there alone. Why didn't you tell me right there? Mm -hmm. You were acting all happy and giddy and hee hee and everything like that. You know what? You are right. I should have told you when it happened. You should have. And I'm sorry I didn't. I should have told you the first night it happened. You want to know how? Okay, fine. She said. Do you want to know how you can prove you're sorry to me? You really want? You, are you really sorry? A lie detector test. Well, or just you want me to take one? Okay, wait, hold All on. Right. Hold on. How about this? Just do me a favor, okay? Yes, Steve. For the sake of, you know, the thing is, she ain't kicking your ass. She's know. mad at you, but she ain't, you know. And this guy, you know, I could see. No, I can't. You, uh, yeah. But you're young, and when you're young, when it comes to sex, we all do stupid things, right? We I all agree. have slept with people that we probably shouldn't have or whatever. Just please admit to me. Hey, I caught that. Wait, 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 wait. Look, you guys, pay attention to this man or this, you know, whatever right here. Pay attention to how he reacts to what Steve said about we all slept with people we shouldn't have. Watch. Just watch. But you're young. And when you're young, when it comes to sex, we all do stupid things, right? We I all agree. have slept with people that we probably shouldn't have or whatever. Just please. Not me. <laughs> you remember having sex with him. You know what? I do remember having sex with him. <laughs> I do. Man, get the... F <laughs> I do remember now. Man, get out of here, bro. I'm done. I'm done, man. If you guys like this video, man, give it a fat thumbs up. Like, comment, share. Mike Avila Gang, we up out of here, man. I love you guys, man. You guys have a blessed one and a safe one. I'm going to catch you guys on the next one, man. Peace.